test for the Bulgarians against the Barcelona side that has reached this stage with victories over Fram Reykjavik from Iceland, Lech Poznan of Poland and Aarhus from Denmark. They scored a morale-boosting victory over their local rivals and here is number eight Stoichkov. He'll be a man to watch. This is the Barcelona lineup with Amor being preferred to Milia in the number four shirt. Though Milia is one of those on the substitutes bench. As for Stradets, they are without Penev, their leading goal scorer. 21 goals for him this season. He's the nephew of the coach, Dimitar Penev, but he's out suspended for one match. Far left, and Linica restored to the attack after being left out for the game against Real Madrid in the league the previous weekend. Julio Salinas with the first header of the game, and now he's got another chance with his feet. Good ball inside as well, and Julio Alberto continues his run. Good cross for Baccaro, who knocks it back now, and coming in was Amor, but his shots clattered against an opponent. Really good build-up there, involving Julio Alberto and Baccaro at the far post, as he so often is. But straight away, back come uh, Sridets, and it just ran away from Kostadino. It is almost the entire national team at the moment. At least half a dozen of this side have played in a recent international game. Baccaro might well have done better. They were CSKA just a few years ago, and you may remember them putting Nottingham Forest out of the European Cup. They've also beaten teams like Bayern Munich. Stoichkov trying to curl it past Zuba Zaretta didn't have any joy. Can have another go. Well, he's won one or two corners, but not on this occasion. Now Bacha. Nice ball played here as well. Oh, and the through ball's a splendid one from Kostadinov and Stoichkov with a chance here. Stoichkov takes it delightfully. Well, it's come out of the blue, but a goal for Sridets, perfectly executed, and Stoichkov, who's got such a remarkable scoring record in Europe this season, has scored a goal here to stun Barcelona, a delightful chip over Zubizarreta, straight into the middle of the goal. The ball from Kostadinov, perfectly weighted, and Zubizarreta, a little bit unsure there, but there was nothing uncertain about Stoichkov's finish. Barcelona nil, CFKA Sredets one. Dismay for Zubizarreta and his side. And how is that going to affect the tie? Because away goals so vital, of course, in European competition. 25 minutes gone and Sredets have got an away goal. the indefatigable Eusebio with the corner, looking for Roberto's head, now Baccaro's in there, gets a nod on for Lineker. stretch away, and Valov gratefully uh, clinging onto the ball, but Gary Lineker was very, very close indeed here, Baccaro once again using his amazing agility, well, he's out of uh, defence at the moment, if they can get this attack right, and... Uh, they're trying to take on Aloisio, well played by Stoichkov again, Stoichkov with the shot! Wide of that far upright, he is so dangerous this man. You just can't give him an inch. Hammers it in. Cup win his cup, semi-final first leg, free kick for Barcelona. Oh, and nodded away there, only as far as Baccaro, here comes Lineker! The equaliser from the Englishman. There was an element of fortune in there because had the defender not got his head to that ball I don't think Baccaro would have been able to supply the cross Lineker exuberant Julio Alberto lifted it across there was the header by the number two Mladenov which went straight to Baccaro he was able to turn it into the path of Gary Lineker and from then on there was only one result Barcelona have their equaliser Julio Alberto floated it in, but it's when Mladenov, after that touch on by Roberto, it's when Mladenov headed it there. But Baccaro had the chance, and here they come once more, 2-1! What a sensational turnaround! Amor is the goal scorer. 
and Barcelona from one down 60 seconds ago have brought the crowd to their feet they lead 2-1 quite astonishing scenes here at the Nou Camp Stadium I don't think I've ever seen two quicker goals than that literally from the kickoff as you were having a look at the replay of Lineker's goal Barcelona swept downfield worked a more into a shooting position and the ball whistled past Ballon for the second time in those 60 seconds Stadium Barcelona leading CFKA Srodets 2-1 then here in this European Cup Winners Cup semi-final first leg having had a bit of a scare going the goal down running once more by Lineker and Lineker rides that tackle very well too the cross is to Baccaro he knocks it down Roberto shot screams over the top oh that really was a bad pass and Baccaro has got Lineker running free and chances here of a third good stop by Vallon but the danger not gone away yet and Baccaro's there Baccaro really started it, he certainly finished it. Splendid goal again for Barcelona, but uh, question marks about this Redetz defence. The start, they gave the ball away in midfield, Ballot couldn't hold Lineker's shot, and then there was no one there to stop Baccaro, and the little man does it yet again. How many times do we see him poach goals with his head? That's Baccaro's 11th goal of this season. It wasn't uh, well done at all by Julio Alberto, and Aloisio misses it. And uh, once more, Stoichkov was there. Oh, slithering in, but got no strength behind the effort. Keep it up. Stoichkov is always dangerous would be sufficient to take them through on the strength of that away goal scored in the first half and inside the penalty area here now is Kostadinov and that is going to be a penalty Kostadinov brought down he raises his arm in jubilation uh, Ketchen with a shake of the head a point of the arm has awarded Sridets a penalty well there didn't appear to be a lot of danger but Cerner it was who brought Kostadinov down and I think the referee's absolutely right. He took the man out of the game there. He caught him by the right leg. And that is a penalty. And again, the game could be turned upside down because a second Sridets goal, I was just talking about that, a second Sridets goal could be so, so vital to them. These two, if they can uh, get a second Stoichkov, will count double in the event of the scores being level. And he looks confident. Stoichkov against Zubizarreta. Stoichkov tucks it in. 3-2 it is, and you can hear the silence almost. It might may sound a strange thing to say, but the crowd have been stung by that. They were silenced. Stoichkov left-footed. He didn't strike it hard, but hard enough. Zubizarreta guessed the right way to go but it had sufficient power, pace and direction to make it into the net. And the second goal of the game for Stoichkov. <laughs> Corner's too long, but Vaccaro came in and slammed in a shot, which Balov did really well to get down to. He to hurt himself there. Here is that corner. And let's see how Valov handles it. Lineker back, and there must be a goal, surely, for Julio Salinas. 4-2 it is. Lineker it was who knocked it back on the far post. Roberto got a touch. And Julio Salinas is the man who finishes it off to give a much more healthy look to the scoreline. Lineker's header there. The little flick on, and Julio Salinas does the rest. It's a good corner from Bagiristein. Over the top of everybody, Lineker, Roberto, Salinas. So, 4-2 it is. Julio Salinas' first European goal for the club. Oh, the point doesn't look too perturbed.
altogether happy either. Or the linesman coming over, uh, the, one of the Bulgarians coming over to remonstrate with the linesman. To that. And again, the danger is here. And then he's being stretched and pulled apart time after time. And here's Kostadinov waiting for the support. And here's the shot coming in. Zubizarreta down to it. Looking for this fifth goal, which would uh, change it all. Oh, and there must be a chance here. Well, Lineker in a good position. Again, shows his disgust, perhaps, at his own finishing and feels as though he should have had a good... It's a real keenness now about Barcelona to try and get a fifth goal. Vaquero cuts inside, switches the play, Roberto off the crossbar. So lucky to survive there. And here they come once more, and now it is so vital for Barcelona not to give anything away. Stoichkov scoring for it. It's uh, not a very good cross, though. It's a very poor cross. Players will know that there are only a matter of seconds remaining. Indeed, there are no seconds at all remaining. The referee puts the whistle to his lips. And Barcelona have won this first leg tie by four goals to two. A smile from Julio Alberto. Goals then for Lineker, for Amor, for Julio Salinas and for Paquero. It all goes then to the second leg in a fortnight's time at 4-2.